When DJI takes to the sky, we break new ground. It's that simple. Every time we innovate, it becomes the standard. Often imitated, but never replicated. Our newest creation is all this and more. The Phantom 4 is an easy to use flying camera powered by the world's most advanced artificial intelligence technology. Now all you have to do is direct it where to go. Here, let's take a closer look. Look at this thing. It's a total redesign. Polished shell, vented composite core underbelly engineered for strength and weight, sleek, refined, elegant. But there's tremendous strength and elegance. Look, a reinforced gimbal for greater stability. And the motors, refined for increased flight efficiency. Raised so you can go faster without propellers poking into footage where they don't belong. That's gonna come in handy when you're going fast. How fast? That fast. We've added a new sport mode for more experienced pilots to get eye-popping shots, or maybe just to bring out your inner speed demon. Philosopher Immanuel Kant said, all of our knowledge begins with the senses. For the Phantom 4, it's the same exact thing. We've added four sensors, like eyes, in front and underneath, that do sonar detection and point cloud stereoscopic recognition. Look, it can see everything in front of it from nearly 50 feet away and over 30 feet underneath it. Obstacles like trees, rocks, bison. It hits the brakes, full stop. Check this out. The Phantom 4 self-flying innovations are made possible by two revolutionary new features that simplify the flying experience. Tap fly and active track. With tap fly, you need only to tap the live view on screen where you want to go, like say, right there. Right now, the Phantom 4 is intelligently adapting to its surroundings, detecting ground elevation and obstacles in its way. When in tap fly mode, it will even reroute and navigate around an obstruction all by itself. And all you did was tap. Active track allows the Phantom's camera to distinguish specific objects in its viewing path and track them with just a tap of a finger and without any sort of remote receiver. It's this adaptive machine learning that allows the Phantom to understand how you look from every angle, even if it can only see you from one. That means you, a friend, your pet, virtually anything you can think of. And it has a flight range of up to five kilometers. Are you seeing this? The Phantom is flying along encircling a moving subject, capturing smooth, perfect video. This is an incredibly challenging shot to pull off. Ask any pilot. But now, even the most demanding shot becomes uncomplicated, achieved with a simple flick of the stick. By the way, this intelligent technology means return to home is even smarter than before. With this new sensory technology, it returns to you while avoiding and rerouting away from obstacles. It's safer, easier, and more reliable than ever before. The addition of these new autonomous features means more usable shots than ever before. No more setup, no more ruined footage because of a bad angle or camera bump. Now all of your shots are gonna look like this. Or this. Or this. So, that's awesome. The Phantom 4's camera is better than ever. Its new lens is composed of eight separate elements for improved sharpness and chromatic aberration handling. It also shoots in 4K ultra high definition at 24, 25, and 30 frames per second, and 60 and 120 frames per second at 1080. And we couldn't forget the battery. Completely redesigned, reformed to be more compact and easier to access, all while increasing the flight time to 28 minutes all in a composite core unibody which is lighter and sturdier than aluminum. Your senses are what dial you into all aspects of life and the world around you. We are only the capacity of what we experience. The Phantom 4 is the first quadcopter to harness those senses and show you a world without limits. It is truly your flying companion, by your side, actively involved in every adventure and burst of inspiration you might stumble on. With the Phantom 4, the world is your blank canvas. What are you going to do with it?
What if you had a sidekick that could turn you into a creative genius, that turned every photo or video you took into epic awesomeness? This is the Phantom Four, and it's going to be your creative sidekick. So now, don't just make a music video. Make a music video. Or here, don't just fly a kite. Be the kite. Ride a bike. Not that bike. That bike. The Phantom 4 does all the hard work of getting extraordinary shots for you. It's your creative sidekick, your personal director. Don't want to use the stick to go? Then tap to go. And how about that active track? Who's that? You know exactly who that is, don't you? So stop worrying about the shot and get the shot 50 feet in the air. There's also this little thing called obstacle avoidance. The Phantom 4, whoa, whoa. This, this looks pretty complicated. This thing is a technological beast. Anyway, visual and sonar sensing sees obstructions even before you do. Basically, you really have to try hard to do, well, that. Don't do that. Do this. Wait, let's take this one in. Yeah, that's the stuff right there. So you have to ask yourself, do you just want to be part of the herd? or above it. Think you can't do all this? Think again. Phantom 4. Visionary intelligence. Elevated imagination. Creativity is at the heart of every dream, but once the idea is born, you must race against time to bring it to life. DJI introduces the next evolution in speed and intelligence, the Phantom 4. With elegant design dedicated to performance and precision, the Phantom 4 allows you to focus on being as creative as your heart desires. The Phantom 4 combines beautiful design with speed and power, making it the world's most advanced quadcopter. A powerfully integrated sensory network is at the heart of the Phantom 4. Artificial intelligence commands an advanced obstacle avoidance system with front-facing cameras that detect obstacles up to 50 feet away. This innovation takes the fear out of flying. Soar at the speed of imagination. My name is Andy Lewis, and I am a slackliner. The way I look at the world is kind of creative. Slacklining basically is tying a piece of webbing between two points and walking across. I use landscapes where people wouldn't see something original and something beautiful. What you're looking for is, it's hard, hard to describe. You can make something that wasn't once there, now something that is. The DJI Phantom 4 allows me to capture a perspective that gives the, a relevant explanation to what I'm doing. How high it is, how scary it is, how committing it is, how focused you have to be. You can write a story and you can tell people how scary it was and how much effort it took. But unless you can really get a visual that people can connect with, it's really hard to describe. When I'm shooting with the Phantom 4, I'm not, I'm not just shooting a highline, I'm shooting an emotion. I'm, I'm shooting a story. So you find points that are high off the ground, points that create exposure. And exposure creates the mindset of fear, which is kind of the emotion that you are learning to battle. And that emotion is what we're looking for. The adventure is what's fun. It's, it's getting from point A to point B, not just on the line. How do you get up to the top? It's kind of fun to have some help. When I use the Phantom 4, I can just look at the monitor, I see where I want to go on the screen, and I tap to see what's at the top of that tower, actually. And instead of having to climb up there and look at it, you can fly up to 
to get approach shots, to get a sense of the area. Another really cool feature is the obstacle avoidance feature. It helps me not run my drone into different things like rocks or walls or towers. And then it looks like it's going to fly into it. It actually will stop before it damages itself or damages somebody else, which I find is actually kind of brilliant. I also really like that you can select you and have the drone follow you. And I can go out on my line and get perspectives that I otherwise wouldn't be able to do by myself. So I can now go out and film myself solo, which is very nice when you're trying to go places that a lot of people don't go. You go out into the wilderness, and you're looking for something that uh, takes your breath away, I guess. Something that is awe-inspiring. Sometimes you do have to think very hard on how to do things, but sometimes it's just one step at a time one foot in front of the other. I like to get up early in the morning, just to leave the towns behind, you know, it's so busy out here in Queenstown with all the tourism and stuff. I just get to come out here every day and it's work. Like the mountains are so beautiful and the scenery is just insane. I'm pretty lucky to be out here all the time. My name is Bernard Kerr. Uh, my profession is downhill mountain biking. Yeah, it's a pretty dangerous sport. You can crash in the blink of an eye. The Phantom 4 camera is so useful, it's got a follow me feature and it's just so easy to use. It's just awesome to have that thing following you and just getting the sticker shots. If you're not the best flyer or anything really, it's going to stop by itself before it hits a tree. Bon ben, salut David, euh, je m'appelle Yannick, je viens de Sacré-Cœur, un beau petit village à 15 minutes de Tadoussac et euh, je suis directeur de la ferme 5 étoiles euh, depuis 2007. Parce que notre mission, c'est toujours d'essayer de sauver l'animal qui arrive à la ferme. La première chose que je fais quand, avant de partir avec les chiens, c'est d'aller les voir. Déjà, ceux que tu vas flatter, que tu leur donnes de l'attention, ils vont déjà penser que c'est eux qui vont partir avec toi. Ben, c'est un respect mutuel des deux parties, une équipe de travail. Ben, d'avoir un Fantôme 4, qu'est-ce qui est... Est-ce que je vais être capable de piloter ça? Et à partir du moment que j'ai eu cette petite machine-là, euh, j'ai rapidement vu qu'il n'y avait rien de compliqué. Tu n'as pas besoin d'être un bon pilote. Premièrement, parce qu'il est capable de lever tout seul. Au niveau de nos animaux, euh, on a euh, des orignaux, on a des bisons, on a des chevreuils, des loups. Parce que quand tu viens euh, familier avec des animaux, puis tes regards, qu'un gars comme toi ne verra pas qu ce que nous, on voit. Une des choses que, que j'adore avec cette machine-là, c'est qu'à partir du moment que je vais perdre un animal, bien, je vais être capable de le traquer et de le voir très rapidement. Et ça peut nous faire sauver du temps, puis ça peut nous aussi nous, nous, nous éviter euh, des, des, que l'animal y aille trop loin. Deuxième des choses, ben, il n'ira pas se cracher, parce qu'il y a un système dedans qui fait qu'il va stopper avant l'arbre, qui va euh, arrêter avant de foncer dedans. Ça m'a permis de prendre des vues 
incroyable sur nos terres. Nous aussi, on est habitué de voir des photos à partir de terre, mais là, de, des airs, c'est complètement différent. C'est un outil incroyable. On a quand même beaucoup de terrain et c'est ce qui nous permet de faire des beaux grands parcs à nos animaux pour qu'ils se sentent le plus dans nos habitats naturels qu'est la nature. Puis ça, c'est une, une belle cause pour nous. When I go out running, it makes me feel good. Um, I love to explore. It just takes my head away. It's a passion. <laughs> my name is Simone and I'm a multi-sport triathlete. One of the cool features of the Phantom 4 is I can select myself. I hit the go button and it will follow me wherever I go. I've been running or training for pretty much my whole entire life. That's all I remember, even as a young kid I was out running all the time and I just kept on going. Having a Phantom 4 to train with, it's actually pretty cool for analyzing my running technique. So now I can film myself running and I can send it to my coach or my partner. With your position, you know, your upper body, you should run relaxed and You get quite tense sometimes and um, the same with your heel. It's huge and the best thing about it, I don't need any other person to help me with it. It's just me and the Phantom 4 and it's not just running, it's I think in all the disciplines, if it's running, swimming, kayaking, whatever sports you do, you know, you want to improve. In 2015, DJI alone broke new ground in sensory systems and intelligence. Now, those advancements have been united with our newest quadcopter, the Phantom 4. A new sensory network is at the heart of the Phantom 4's obstacle avoidance system. A pair of front-facing cameras see and detect obstacles as far as 50 feet away, while downward-facing cameras capture optical and sonar data. All of this data is sent to the flight controller, the brain of the Phantom. At the same time, a hardware redundancy system isolates incorrect data and invalidates it. Dual IMUs measure inertia, and a barometer measures altitude via air density, while an enhanced GPS module allows for connectivity to 36 satellite signals. The flight controller sends all of this information to four motors, which make intricate, coordinated adjustments in mid-air. This obstacle avoidance system takes the fear out of flight. The Phantom 4 sets a new standard in quadcopter intelligence and has quickly become the most forward-thinking and advanced Phantom ever made.